public needs to know there's short staffing. They need to know the toxic work environment. Well, a big showing from a local post office workers today, unhappy over their working conditions. Fox 9's Bab Santos was there, and he joins us now live after that event, Babs. Yeah, upset employees today said this is a problem that's been growing over the last decade. Who's post office? Postal workers rallied outside of the Egan Post Office on Saturday, demanding improved working yes. conditions. Better postal staffing! Better postal service! and other changes to what they're calling a toxic work environment across the system caused by low staffing. Better postal service. Short staffing creates bad morale in your back offices. It has your postal supervisors pushing employees to do more with less, to skip breaks. Shorter line. Local American Postal Workers Union President Dave Cook says some employees are also harassed for missing work when sick. He organized the weekend protest to call on USPS management to do better. Treat your employees with respect. Um, they deserve time off. They deserve breaks. Uh, they deserve to not be talked down to on the job site. Dignity! Respect! Dignity! Respect! Mail processing clerk Dana Fitzpatrick says she sees the effects firsthand. We see each other more than we see our own families half of the time. USPS responded Saturday writing, the position being presented here by the leadership of APWU is absent of anything based in reality. The facts are that over the past two years, we have worked diligently with our union and management associations to address our shared goals of employee recruitment and retention, workplace safety, and career training and advancement. This is not the end! Only Cook and others on hand Saturday counter that while the post office is addressing recruitment, turnover remains high because of an unchecked toxic work culture. The back of your post office so the customer doesn't see it working six, seven days a week, 10, 14 hour days. Uh, so their statement is partially true. Today's statement from the post office continued saying, we have already reversed years of declining service reliability, and now 98% of the nation's population receives their mail and packages in less than three days. Live in Egan, Bab Santos, Fox 9.